Now, heavy clashes have broken out between Armenian and Azerbaijani forces in the disputed Nagorno-Karabakh region. Both sides have reported military and civilian casualties in the worst escalation since 2016. Both Armenia and Azerbaijan were part of the Soviet Union before its collapse in 1991. For decades, they have been stuck in an unresolved conflict over Nagorno-Karabakh. The region is internationally recognized as part of Azerbaijan, but controlled by the ethnic Armenians. In a fresh flare-up of tensions, Armenia said Azerbaijan launched an air and artillery attack over the region. It said the military shot down two Azerbaijani helicopters and three drones in response to the attack. While Azerbaijan blamed Armenia and said it was responding to shelling along the whole front. In a televised address, President Ilham Aliyev has vowed victory over Armenian forces. While Armenian Prime Minister Nikol Pashinyan declared martial law in the country and urged his people to defend their homeland. Turkey's President Tayyip Erdogan has pledged support for Azerbaijan, calling Armenia the biggest threat to peace in the region. Meanwhile, Russia, France and Germany have called for an immediate ceasefire.